Krishan Rock responds to Blueface, claiming he took another DNA test, proving Junior is not his. I decide to leave my kid with y'all. Do I have to watch out for the bitch? I don't even have to watch out for the bitch. It's not even her. It's Blueface. Blueface is the issue. He's the weirdo. He's the of this whole situation, for real, for real. And then he got a bitch doing his dirty work when she's not even like... Like, you know what I'm saying? It, it got nothing to do with her. That that's the that's the that's the weirdo fucked up part about all this shit. It got nothing to do with nobody but me and my baby daddy. And his weird ass got just jealousy issues. So you know why I'm like, you know, moving my little um you know how I'm moving. I'm moving my own little way right now. Like, all right, I'm having my way for real. Like I got for real. We cool, but we're taking shit slow. Like nobody we not even like on some intimate shit. Like we Want some best friend shit? I'm here for you, woo, woo, woo. and like, yeah, like whatever. Like we taking shit slow. The f Long story short, it's 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 hurting Blueface. Like it's breaking his little heart. So this weird ass. While I'm at the studio, and I'm doing what I'm doing, he can't get in no contact with me. So he go to my house, drunk as shit. First of all, you're supposed to be in jail for exposing my son. You're supposed to be in jail for having a kid. First of all, don't be having my child. Then try to like go to you. He was trying so hard to get to his house so he can call the cops and say that I'm trespassing and I can't come up in their house because he's just an evil bitch ass, weird ass. So I beat him before he even get to his house. We at the gate squabbling up for real. And then I tell him to get in my car because it's like we all finna get locked up for domestic your bitch ass don't get up in this motherfucking car. He like, Jay and Marsh right here. I said, Jay and Marsh can take the black truck and get in the motherfucking truck. Get in the Bentley. Let's go. Next, we're about to get locked up. Who knew where my phone is, bitch? I don't know where your phone is. I don't know where my phone is. Get in the car with the baby because you're not trying to give me the baby. But it's cold. Like, you're not, you're, you're drunk. You're drunk. This nigga leaves penthouse drunk. Go get my son. Get in a car accident. Bro, this nigga should be in jail. And like, he's abusing the fact that I don't play the police games for real. Like, back in the day when he used to first beat shit out of me, I used to call the cops all the time. Um, I even got a restraining order from the last time he when he first first beat the shit out of me in front of that BGC crib in front of all those girls. So, and. When, like, I don't like when police get in, they get in your business for real. I'm not really good with the cops no more. Like, you feel me? I did my fair share of calling the cops. I'm over that shit. So right now, he know I'm over that police game. So his bitch ass, he low-key will do the police games, plus the street shit, plus the, the crib shit or whatever. So this weird ass nigga just, just pissing me the fuck off because it's like, he want me to talk about it again. Like... What do you want from me, bro? Like, what the fuck? So he's like, so uh, the baby's over there with you. The baby's going to be wherever I go. He's going to be protected. He's going to be safe. He's going to be with his mother mom. You know why? Because when I had a funny feeling when I left him with Marsh, I paid this bitch $1,000 an hour. That's why when she when when he woke up trying to take the baby, she was like, you going to take me too. Till Krishan get to us because respectfully, nigga. That's what she paid for. So, yeah. So, yeah. This weird ass is just like a weirdo. Like, he really a fucking weirdo. Like, real shit. So, now, I got all my control, though. That's why I had my baby in Baltimore. That's why I didn't put him on no birth certificate. So, still my baby again. Respectfully, it's not your child. You know why? Because where's the proof? In spite of that DNA test we took on our TV show, yeah, we have proof. We know this is your kid, but he doing so, so much damage shit. I had to make sure he wasn't on no birth certificate. I had to make sure I was more in control of the situation because the situation is fucked up, okay? Because, like, I don't know what man will expose their son after him getting a car accident. The baby don't got no, it's no, he didn't grab the diaper bag or nothing. He just left the crib. Like, he could just survive on, I don't, I don't know what the fuck he, he's up against, but he's weird. Like, he's, he's battling stuff. He's going through shit, and then he's taking it out on his son. 
And he think he's he think he's hurting me when really he's hurting his son and he's hurting himself. Because I'm over here happy as shit with my new nigga, but I keep getting sucked into the bullshit because this shit just won't let up on the bullshit. I don't know what's his problem. So last night, this just kept crying like, what is he crying about? Oh, he called me and said, did you give, you never give me a gift. So I'm basically, I'm like, so you going to let a bitch, because the bitch, you know, Jaden, we was drunk, we was swapping information, but I don't know if she fabricated anything. I don't know what the fuck she said. Whatever she said triggered him, because he called me saying, yeah, whoop de -woo told me that you bought Suave a gift. You mad that I bought a nigga something from the jeweler? What if I didn't? What if I did? What? Why the fuck does it matter? Why are you calling me talking about a gift? You never give to me that old crib. That's not my baby. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. So I be texting him like, yeah, I love you, bro. Keep going. You got this. I be trying to motivate him to stay positive because I'm scared to sleep at my house. This nigga will come in my house either asking for pity or he's going to beat the shit out of me. Look at all these fucking bruises, bro. Like, my eye was black the other day. I got stomped out on each side of my body, bro. Like, hold on. Where the other marks at? Oh, he kicked me because, you know that rug that Swami gave me? He kicked me. We don't see. He kept kicking me. Like, he kept kicking me. These are bruises that's still healing. I don't have none of my... My nose ring got knocked out. My earrings, all my crosses, but one cross is still standing on my body, bro. So, when I avoided them all together, this bitch ass became like a thief in the knife and stole my baby for more attention. So, what I'm thinking is, and he know I'm not playing those police games because I'm trying to clear up my warrants right now. I have court, all type of shit, bro. But I swear to God, bro, I'm finna go to the motherfucking police station and just say, these warrants. Both of us need to be in jail then because it's like, how am I going to protect my son from somebody that's such a first it was his now, now, and then my baby, I think he got a cold from that night. Like it's like congested all type of shit. Like what? Like what? I'm like, bro, this shit is ill. So last night I'm like, he like. So then he tried to make the gift, whatever I gifted, whatever I gifted Suave. He tried to make the gift a reason to beef. So he was like, okay, so you ain't gift that booty boo. I said, what are you talking about? I don't know what you're talking about. Do you want to see your son? What are you talking about? What are we, what are we talking about? He like, did you or did you not answer the question? I'm like, so you let in your other BM Make you mad at me because of what I gave another nigga, supposedly. Supposedly. And I'm only saying supposedly because I'm going to watch my mouth. Because the way you get triggered, the way shit make you mad is really, really sick. Like. And why you keep coming to my house, bro? Like on some like demon time, like. He know I don't play those police games, so he's like, bitch, let's burn out. I'm not burning out. I am okay. I do not deserve none of this shit that's happening to me. I'm really trying to focus on being happy, being in a different... So he's like, oh, crap, that's not my baby. Thanks for tuning in to Nine Mag TV.